Hey, 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 Roblox Whoa here. How are you doing, my friends? Ayo, hey, today we're gonna talk about the best of the best dragon games on Roblox. It's about time we soar into the skies. Before we get to soaring though, I'd like to ask you something. What's the best known dragon movie where the protagonists are training them as pets and companions? The person to get the correct answer will have their comment liked and pinned, and the answer to this question is hidden somewhere in the video maybe. And so without further ado, let's get started, shall we? Dragon's Life, a free roam dragon roleplay game as the name suggests. You can play as a dragon which ranges from an adult, teen, child, or even an egg. Yes, you can play as an egg in this game. The elements you choose act as your powers and of course you can fly. It also has good animations on being a dragon like sitting, sleeping, laying, roaring, and many more. It's a pretty weird game since there's a school and an adoption center. Like what the hell? Dragon Adventures is a game where you can raise a dragon, literally, and turn it into a powerful beast. Find a variety of dragon species, design your base or plot, raise and protect them, dragon fellas, defeat enemies and other players, fly and grow crops so you can feed them. Some of the game's features include tons of dragon quests, not the Dragon Quest RPG, but the Dragon Quests, Quests for Dragons missions. These missions are the objectives that you need to do in order to get tons of awards. These quests reward you with gold or coins, which you can use for dragon breeding, like discovering new types of dragons. There's also crops in this game, which will act as the food for your dragons. There's also a base editor, which allows you to decorate your base however you like, explore 11 different worlds, and immerse yourself into the worst possible mechanic of gotcha and minigames. Another one of those dope games where you can ride dragons, Dragon Riders, is a game where you can ride and raise magical dragons. Like, wow, I'm impressed. The dragons here are far different from the dragons in the Dragon Adventures or Dragon Life. I don't know how, but they look like snakes to me. The game features customizations for unique and interesting gears, skins, and purchasable items through quests. You can explore the main lobby to get some coins and collect as many dragons as you can. There's also dailies in this game which will reward you by logging in every day. The best part of the game is the dragon battles. Just to give you an idea of how this dragon battle works, it's like Slither.io. Yes, like Slither.io. Fiorana is a continent inhabited by anthropomorphic animals who explore its ancient landscape to discover the many secrets. Here in Fiorana, you can choose a species of your liking, a cat, wolf, dragon, fox, manikit, they also got a door, bruh, a ball, really? Fox with wings, a worm, wolf, a rat, a human, and it's really wild in here. You can customize your character's color, accessories, and hair, travel across the expansive world of Fiorana, make friends and find hidden locations, and of course, socialize, roleplay, and create long-lasting epic storylines in a safe environment. About the map, it's pretty diverse and big, quite realistic depending on what you think realism is. Dragon Versus is a game where you can play, unlock dragons, and train to learn new moves, kind of like an arena fighting game. There are 11 different types of dragons in this game, each with their own unique base stats and skills. And speaking of skills, there are a lot of moves that your dragon can learn. Use your skill points to unlock the other skills, and there are dailies in this game, so pretty standard game for me. Dragon Rage is a game, a very exciting game, in which the goal is to survive. It's an arcade game which will test your survival skills and reaction time. The dragons will slowly destroy the terrain, creating large holes and gradually shrink the map. If a dragon strikes you, they will send you flying. What you're going to do in this is to dodge your attacks and jump across the broken terrain to avoid falling into water. Doing so will award you tokens, which can be spent on in-game items and accessories to aid your survival. You you can also gain experience to increase your level and fight for position on the leaderboard. 
How to Train Your Dragon RP Burke's Dragons is a game all about dragons in a massive role playing game. Explore and make friends. And this game is a fan made game in by the hit movie How to Train Your Dragon. In this game, you have the ability to choose between 23 types of dragons. Some dragons are free, some are gated behind game passes. It's a nice game, but it's just lacking some few role play elements, but it's a decent role play game. Elemental Dragon Tycoon is a dragon dropper based game. Each tycoon floor features different elements using various weapons to defend your tycoon from other players and bosses. There's also dailies, loots from bosses, and tons of element based weapons to choose from. Dragon Simulator is a collection based simulator game. In this game you can team up with others or go solo and use your army of dragons to crush fruits and monsters. Some of the game's features include dailies, dragons, weapons and bosses that you can fight forever. Dragon's Fury is an official sequel of the game's Dragon's Rage in which they added some twists in the game. This game now has pets better accessories, new materials for your pads and clothes, better lobbies with terrains, new sets of gears, cosmetics, and dragons. A pretty good game than Dragon's Rage overall. Alright friends, this is it for now. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and comment on the correct answer for this week's question. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Whoa.